What's up guys? Some B2 back. And I uh, haven't posted an Aram's game in a while and got into a, a match here with my old buddy Twisted Fate. So uh, I figured I would post something on this Sunday afternoon. I'm not quite ready to ascend in Clicker Heroes, so uh, so here we go. Twisted Fate and Aram's. Kind of a, has a neat little teleport on here. He's got cards, so his Q throws wild cards in that, that formation there. So like it's gonna hit like if I was to throw that it would wouldn't hit him there. Oh no. Oh no. I was trying to explain to you guys. So the uh, the W it puts up a blue card which will do damage, a red card which will do magic damage, and a gold card which actually stuns. So the red card does damage, the blue card will restore mana. The gold card stuns for a second, so pretty cool. <laughs> That's funny rise laying on the ground. We, we've we've got some nice poke here and a really good ADC. So whoa, 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 whoa! The game froze for a second. Not cool. Who's that? Brand? That is. Oh, that's Brand, not Rise. Brand's gonna sit there and pick us apart, man. First blood. Wrong card, but that's alright. Brand, you're starting to get on my nerves, buddy. Starting to get on my nerves up there in that bush. Pow! Got him with the side card. Not cled off his horse, that's what I'm talking about. Got a little piece of uh, a what's his name over there too. Hmm. You know that card right down the minion line to do the most damage for your team and kind of speed things up a little bit. But oh yeah, we cut into Brandon. Got a little piece of Vagar there, old Vagar. Hmm. Yeah, got him for a 112 cut. Three, two. One and then right, right up the minion line. Watch. That's how you want to use Twisted Fate early. Uh, you definitely want to help your team get a an early lead on the minions for sure. Just trying to get up. Yeah. Oh, uh, don't go. Uh, you're not gonna get out of that. Oh, we're out of mana. The front, the straight up card is hard, is, is easy to dodge. But the, um, the side card, like, people have a hard time dodging that. So you want to see if you can angle. Alright, so we're going to have to come back and heal now. Hopefully we got some of these little things ready to go. Welcome to the dope show. Yeah, got him. <laughs> that flash stun card. Holler if you hear me. Watch the side card. I'll be the one that gets him. But we got hits all the way down the row of the minions, and that's where you want to be at. Gonna be taking these minions out and pushing them back because once the minions push in, they can kind of hide behind them. So, Pan Pantheon, I don't get it. Well, people do that, man. They dive knowing they're gonna die to come and get you, but it is what it is. 
Get a little speed up of here. You know, I should have gone. I think that's Luden's too. Yeah. Let's go Luden's Echo first. Get that splash damage. Uh, no, take care of the minions. We got a Sivir who came to play. Seven and one. Got Pantheon though. <laughs> and what can we get? Can we bolster anything? We can't. Let's wait for let's wait for this Ludens. I shouldn't have chased so hardcore, but they came in to dive under the tower for me. Get off my nutsack. Throwing snowballs. It's like the worst part of Arams. People who can't really play, they rely on these stupid snowballs, man. Yeah, come on in for that trade one more time, bruh. Yeah, Vigar. Keep not looking again, buddy. Come on, Vi. Yeah, panties on. Three, two, one. Right up the minion wave. And panty on. He was lucky he was in flight there, man, because I got him. back and grab me some uh, some health and some energy look at Pantheon trying to use his little uh, his little alt to get behind us to get me and stun me he had a good plan oh real for real but look who's still running around twisted tango and we're on the next tower which is also lovely and we'll throw this out there Trying to collect on this cash. There's no health in here anywhere. Look at Ezreal. <laughs> Got him.
Oh, we missed that. <laughs> Horrible shot. I don't need mana. No mana. <laughs> We're hurting kind of awful. This team's a walking penta. That's lame. That's the lamest move. Lamest move. But that's all right. I'm gonna use my lame move and then die again. But he's probably has a pretty good record this soon. Nine and ten. 9, 10, and 3. See, this this is like not a team player, and I'll tell you why. Because 3 assist? What good are you doing the team? 3 assist? You're not doing the team good. You're just headhunting. You're going for... He's, he's headhunting. He's 1 and 7. But, like, look. This is when you have a team. 11 assist. 19 assist. But, look. 4 and 5 with 11 assist? I'd rather have someone like that on my team. You know you're doing overall damage, and you're feeding them to your ADC, which is 15 and 4. And that's how you're going to carry. And you got guys like me who are just going to go... Ah, we can't get it off. We can get a card on him. Oh, we couldn't get a, quite get a card there. And I killed him on the end. <laughs> so not a bad game. We're going to end up in a pretty good game. This should be pretty much the match right here. We're going to end up positive with, you know. We're going to really start to hurt if they if they delay this game any. He's probably going to get Sivir though. Pantheon is really good, man. Like, Sivir is definitely putting the hurt on him. And then now he's got Gangplank to help him. <laughs> Goodbye, buddy. Goodbye. They better get in on there on the clear this. See, Vigar should be clearing these minions out, man. With his dug oh, he's done now, Vigar. I probably won't even get up there in time. Yeah. Oh, we got last kill <laughs> on the uh, on the on the teleport. I love it, man. Pretty good twisted fate game. That gives you a good idea. Wasn't great, wasn't bad, but I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. Let's check out the damage. And when you focus on the minion waves, you should come pretty far. Yeah, see, we were pretty high up there in damage, even before our ADC. Uh, we had a really strong Gangplank, though, that helped out. And see, if you look at the stats here with Gangplank, Exotic Wizard 10, he's 8-6, but he has 14 assists. Sometimes you, you get a Gangplank who just wants to make just kills, 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 but you really need to feed him to Sivir. Uh, a silver late game uh, crits so hard it's hard to stay up with so let's go ahead and give these guys all teamworks man i like that i like teams like this and i uh, hope you guys have a great sunday get ready for the super bowl and uh, i'll see you guys later holla